What might have been a misdirected Twitter message has Secretary of State Connie Lawson in hot water. Democrats say Lawson or someone in her office used a state account to try and round up support for Lawson's re-election. RTV6 reporter Norman Cox has more. The Secretary of State's office is keeping a closed mouth on the Twitter incident, which Indiana Democrats say violates ethics laws. This is the tweet that started it all. It's a message from Secretary of State Connie Lawson asking Hoosiers to please follow her campaign at Vote Connie for updates on the 2014 race. That's when her term is up. It also asks followers to please like her campaign Facebook page. The problem is the tweet came out on at Secretary Lawson, which is her official state Twitter account. Lawson admitted to a Lake County newspaper that the account was used for political purposes, but that she didn't do it. However, her office spokesperson, Valerie Kroger, told the paper she deleted the tweet, but that Lawson had posted it from her iPhone. The right hand didn't know what the left hand was doing. Um, it shows a lack of accountability uh, when there was a dispute over who tweeted and whether the account was official or whether it wasn't. And so I think um, our message here is that uh, this is the party of uh, her, her predecessor was, was convicted of voting fraud, and, and this shows some lack of transparency or accountability in being able to follow ethics laws and, 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 and election law. Kroger said Lawson wasn't available to answer questions today, and Kroger declined to be interviewed on camera. But Kroger did say it had been determined that a staff member, she didn't say who, had tweeted the message. The Twitter incident follows right on the heels of another dispute between Lawson and Indiana Democrats. In that one, she rejected their complaint that Marion County Republicans had violated the law by auctioning off a TV at a gay pride event at which they were also trying to register people to vote. At the State House, I'm Norman Cox, RTV6. Now, Lawson was appointed Secretary of State by former Governor Mitch Daniels after her predecessor, Charlie White, was removed from office after his convictions for voter fraud, perjury, and theft.